Hello, Brent with all of Octane here. And in this video, I'm going to be opening up the Hot Wheels uh, Collectors, I guess it's actually Mattel Creations, uh, Ford Bronco Wrangler. So it's not actually a Jeep Wrangler, it's the Ford Bronco, but it is the Wrangler Edition. So like Wrangler jeans, kind of like what you would see on the Dale Earnhardt car from back in the day. Wrangler since 1947. It's got the 85 Ford Bronco. Quite a hefty box. This thing is solid and quite large. So let's go ahead and open this up and see what we've got. Do they have tape on it? Doesn't look like they have tape on it. Interesting. No tape on either side. Well, that's unique. We've got the box. Let's go ahead and open that up. Is it? Oh, it is. Does have screws. I'm trying to see those okay so i do have that ready and available as well we'll do that here in just a second let's unveil the 85 ford bronco ta-da there it is that is a pretty cool piece and is it numbered it doesn't look like it's numbered so well, let's uh let's open it up We've seen this casting for a number of years now. I think this kind of started back in the 80s. I think it had some black walls on it, if I'm not mistaken. And it's interesting that these are chrome, not, or I guess I say chrome, but these are not black screws. These are the standard color of what you would kind of see a screw in was it steel there we go off the base let's take a look no more glare since 1947 wrangler i'm surprised there's no information you know like normally mattel does a little bit of a write-up and there is none for this kind of surprising yeah but here's the side of it and honestly, it probably wouldn't be too hard to custom make this because these Broncos are pretty easy to find from like the 90s. And you can find the tires. I'm pretty sure the wheels might be part of those wheel packs that Mattel came out with. I don't know if these specific ones are, but I have a feeling you could probably find these on a vehicle that uh, could be a donor. I feel like maybe like the Ford Raptor that sat on the pegs for a long, long time back four or five years ago. Kind of a bummer that the spare tire is not a full size tire, like rubber, but yeah, that's okay. Nothing tampoed on the bottom, but it does have the 85 Ford Bronco. It does have the Wrangler tampos up top. I'm trying to think, is this, I think that's, part of the casting. It doesn't look plastic because I know back in the day they used to be plastic, but this does look like it is metal. The post here goes all the way down to the, to the body. Great temple work on the sides. It definitely fits that eighties look for sure. And the Wrangler aspect of it. I wish I had another Ford Bronco to compare it to one of the originals. I had one of the originals as a kid, but I think the tire broke. And I also think maybe, no, the top didn't break, but the tire broke off. I don't actually know how that happened. This uh, metal bull bar is integrated into the body, the grill, and the body is on top of that. So all of this portion, again, kind of a bummer, no tire, but it's just kind of nice to see. And again, it's kind of strange that they didn't have any um, writing for it or write up for it. it. Does just sit right back on and yeah, could store it quite easily or display it quite easily either way. Trying to see how this goes, probably this way. Yeah, I think that's the way it went. Like that. 
So there you have it. There is the 85 Ford Bronco Wrangler edition from Hot Wheels Creations. Let me know if you got this truck. Let me know if you like it or not. Let me know if you want to see Mattel make other Ford Broncos. Let me know in the comments below and until the next one, have a good one.